Hey nesters, welcome back to Nesting Haven. Today I'm sharing with you a Goodwill thrift haul. I cut my last thrift haul a little bit short because I decided I wanted to separate the clowns from everything else because there are a lot of people for some reason that are afraid of them. They find clowns to be creepy. So if you are afraid of clowns, this is not the video for you. I do have a, another thrift haul of just regular home decor that I'll be sharing with you tomorrow. So come back for that if you do not want to see the clowns. Now clowns to me, I don't find them creepy. I've liked them ever since I was a kid. Our local Shriners every year would put on a circus and they always dress up as clowns. So I've always found them to be, you know, a charitable, nice thing. So I haven't really been creeped out by them. With that said, I do know some clowns tend to look a little creepier than others, but I try to pick up just the happy looking clowns. <laughs> So let's go ahead and start with this one here. I have picked up one of these before. I actually have one listed in my Etsy already, so this will be another one to put up. And this is a two-faced clown. So it's happy on this side and sad on this side, and you know, it's just like a little mood tracker, kind of fun. And both of mine are painted different because they are hand-painted pieces. But yeah, I think these are pretty fun and it's a little whimsy, so that one will be available up in my Etsy as well. This one here I think is actually a jester. It kind of fits with the clown theme, so I thought I'd add him into it. And he's just a cute little coin bank. He's peeking around a column here, does have the plug in it, and he's in pretty good condition. Has a little bit of, you know, paint wear, little scuffs, but not too bad. And he'll probably go for about $16.99 on my Etsy. I don't too often pick up the more matte porcelain styled figurines because I just prefer the glazed look, but I did kind of like this guy here. I thought he looked pretty nice even though he is a matte. And he has these little balloons he's hiding behind his back almost like you would with a bouquet of flowers, but he's a clown so he's going to give you balloons, right? And yeah, it looks like he's going to a birthday party or something so I thought he was kind of cute there and yeah, he'll probably be about $15.99 on Etsy. This one here is more of a kitschy cute one. You would find this probably in a nursery more likely. It has this really nice cloth rainbow hat to it and he's kind of just being cute there with his little pose. So yeah, I thought he was pretty cute and he'll probably go for about $14.99 with shipping included. The next vintage clown I have to share with you is this one here. He's kind of in this primary colored polka dot. I believe he's juggling. He has two balls. Technically, you need three <laughs> to juggle, but I think that is what he's supposed to be doing there. And yeah, he's just kind of cute. So he does have a little wear on his red clown nose, but I think he's pretty cool. This is one of my favorite ones I picked up. He was super cute. He's kind of doing jazz hands. <laughs> I love how bright and colorful he is. He's hand painted ceramic. He does have a little bit of cloth someone has gone ahead and glued on it so it doesn't scratch your surface that you set it on. And yeah, I just think he's really nicely painted. He has these polka dots on this bright lime green on the back and his hat kind of matches there, so. Very cute. This guy would probably go for about $28. This one here is one I was definitely leaning towards keeping. He's a good size and I like that he's laying down. You don't see that with figurines too often. Usually they're just kind of statues standing up, but very unique. I love the colors to him. He's very bright down to his purple shoes. <laughs> and yeah, I just really liked his look. He's very happy. And he might be juggling as well. He's holding a couple of balls there. And yeah, I really like him. Look at the floral on his hat. Fun. And yet another really adorable one. These three were by far my favorite. Obviously came from the same home. They had to have. <laughs> they look very similar and hand painted. And this one is actually a bank. So there's a little coin slot there. It does have the plug and there's a sticker on it. It says it's by Nanco, so it was made in Taiwan, which would be probably around the 1980s. So very, very cute. I just love his little pose there, adorable. I have a couple of clowns that are playing guitars, which I thought was really neat. 
I come from a family that is a long line of musicians, so anything with kind of musical instruments, especially the guitar, kind of makes me smile. So, you know, the circus clown, he was very entertaining back in the day. That was the go-to source of entertainment is, you know, everyone got to go to the circus. And of course, they were probably musicians as well there. So it's neat that they blended the two. I've never seen a guitar playing clown before, but I would like to see that. <laughs> this one's kind of cute here. And he has kind of a mischievous smile, but I thought that was fun. The other guitar playing clown is this one here. He's more of a trophy and I'm not quite sure what the deal is with that, but it's on like a trophy. It's a heavy duty, like paperweight trophy style block here. And yeah, he's almost, he's like some type of a resin. He's not actually even ceramic, but I think he's super cute there. So he will be available as well. This one here is a matte porcelain. And I just thought he was kind of different looking. He wasn't the overly colorful clowns, which I tend to gravitate towards. But there was just something about him. It seemed like he was like, you know, maybe an uncle back in the day that would, you know, dress up for their nephew's party or something to just, you know, make them smile or something. So I thought he was pretty cute there. And I like his little pose. <laughs> This one here, again, I thought was kind of different. He is laying down on his belly, posing as well. And he's just this nice little black and white clown, which you don't see hardly ever. He does have the yellow hair to give it a pop of color, but I don't know, he's just kind of neat. He almost looks like he might be more of a jester as well, but I thought he was kind of fun. I also picked up this circus clown. He is walking on a ball, he has some balloons, and he is a music box. So I thought he was kind of fun there. He does have a little bit of paint wear to him, mostly on the ball, but that is to be expected for vintage items. When I was a kid, my room was decorated in clowns and unicorns. So I always kind of had a thing for them. I've always, you know, liked clowns. And one clown in particular I always have liked are the hobo clowns. I always find them endearing. And so this one here is kind of a hobo clown doll. And he has a, like a wooden block inside of him so he can be like a shelf sitter. And he can sit up like that. I don't know if I can quite do him here. Yeah, I guess he'll be okay. So he just kind of sits like that and he has this nice little polka dotted outfit on him. And he does have some like plastic hands and feet, but I thought he was kind of fun as well. And would be nice on a shelf on a kid's room that's not afraid of clowns, but I liked him. I also picked up this, I think it was like $3 or something like that. And it was just so different to have a clown wreath. And I just thought they had handmade him really well. It's made out of yarn and yeah, he has this plastic little face. He's a doll, but then they have these cute little birthday balloons on it and they've gone ahead and stitched him around this metal ring to make him a wreath. So obviously someone probably used this as a birthday decor at some point back in probably the 70s, 60s, 70s era. And I thought it was really fun. So I will have that available up in my Etsy. I wonder if anybody is still watching or if they're just completely creeped out by this point seeing all these clowns. <laughs> I have this other clown item. He is ceramic and he's really neat because he has a, this extension of a string. They are a wall art piece. They have hanging spots there so you would hang it up on the wall. I can change it that way. See, like this. So it kind of off centers, looks super cute. I love these kind of wall decor pieces. And yeah, I really liked him. He has a slight bit of paint wear on his red clown boot there, but nothing too serious. I have a few more items to share with you before I share the creepiest clown I got. I'm gonna save that for the end. But these items are more, it kind of just reminded me of maybe circus theme. So I decided to add them in with this haul. The first one is actually a Noah's Ark boat, but it's this cardboard hanger. You can have, you know, hang it up here. There's a little circle for it. It is vintage. I don't know the age of it, but it looks super old. It does have some vintage wear to it. The giraffe is got some damage up here on his ear and someone has bent it. So on the backside, you can see it has a pretty big crease where it's been bent, but it is still intact. You can see the front there. 
it's not all the way through. So it didn't completely break. And what else? I think that was the main issue. There's, you know, a little bit of wear on the corners, but overall, I think it's super cute. Anyone that is doing a vintage nursery or Nora's Ark seems to be very popular for nurseries. So I thought that would be cute to go ahead and add in. I'll probably ask about maybe, maybe 20, 25 for it. We'll see how it does. I did find a couple of elephant items to add into this haul. I thought it'd be nice to add in with the clowns, the circus theme, right? So the first one is this here. It is a porcelain, it has a nice glaze to it. And it's just a cute little size. So I thought it was kind of kitschy cute. I also got these really nice bookends. They are elephants here they don't have any coin slots in them but they are actually a coin bank they both have plugs in the bottom so it's kind of a neat little way to store your money and not have it found i guess if you want to be kind of secret about it and these were marked $3.99 a piece and yeah so the elephant's uh, eyes i tried to wash this off because it looked a little weird to me but it might have just been that way intentionally because they are exactly the same on both of them. I kind of looked like dirt at first, but I tried to wash it, it didn't come off. So I guess it's just the way it was made, but yeah, nice little bookends there. They'll probably go for about 32, maybe up to $38 with free shipping. I have one last clown to share with you. It is the creepiest of them all. I think he's still cute. I like the way he's made. I'll just show the backside first, <laughs> but it's a, it's almost like a cement it's I don't know what it's made of but it looks really nicely painted and I love the overall I don't really even know how to describe it. it just has a really nice look to it almost like a stoned statue or something but here's his face <laughs> so he's not too bad but out of all of the ones I got I thought he looked the creepiest and I think it's just because his eyes were red really but he has a cute little bunny so does that make up for it <laughs> But yeah, I thought he was really fun as well, and he will be available in my Etsy along with everything else here. So if you happen to like anything, feel free to check out the link is below. So thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know if this creeped you out too much. <laughs> I, I hope it didn't. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I will be sharing with you tomorrow the rest of my Goodwill thrift haul. And then we'll get into some other videos, maybe some more thrifting my home. I think I'm going to show you some of my collections that I have. Some people have been interested in that. Maybe show you some different areas in my home that I decorated, like little pockets of my home, things like that. So we'll get into some fun stuff here soon. And yeah, we'll catch you in the next one. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.